Adam Wall. Hello, how are we doing? Are we OK? Yeah. Good to be here. My name's Adam. Uh, bought this jacket very recently. It's from Primark. Do any of you shop at Primark? Yeah. Two people. <laughs> I love Primark. Do you know what I've discovered, though? Some people hate that shop and don't like you shopping there. I found that out the day I bought this because I put it straight on. I went to meet my friend for a drink and she's sitting with all of her friends. I know these people quite well, but I still call them hair friends because I don't like them. Uh, <laughs> like five minutes in, one of them's like, where's your jacket from? I said, it's from Primark, it's great, isn't it? It was six quid. And this girl made a noise that I'd never heard come from a human being before. It was like a cow having a stroke. She went, Meh. <laughs> I was like, do you want an ambulance or a vest? Tell me how to help you. She was like, actually, I'm offended. I was like, I'm sorry, I never meant to do that. Don't try and offend people. What have I done wrong? She said, well, you shouldn't shop at Primark because the prices are so low. It means that somebody in the third world is being exploited. Those people are on about 11 pence an hour. How do you feel about that? I was like, look, I know what you're saying. Bore. He's already made it now. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's already a jacket. It's not going to go back to being cotton if I don't buy the thing. She's just one of these people who's desperate to be offended by absolutely everything in the world. <laughs> we walked past a homeless guy on the pub crawl that night and he asked for money, so I gave him some. And she goes, oh, my God. I said, what? What have I done now? Wendy, what's the problem with this? You gave the homeless man money and that is wrong. I said, really, what's wrong with helping homeless people? Oh, no, God, no, no. There's nothing wrong with helping these people. But you shouldn't give them money. You should buy them a sandwich. <laughs> oh, well, I think he wants cider, so why don't we ask him? <laughs> I'm willing to accept I might be wrong. Maybe he wants a sandwich, and if he does, I gave him money. He can go and buy whatever sandwich he likes. But don't take the choice away from him, Wendy. You wouldn't like that, would you? No, you wouldn't. No, you wouldn't. It's my round in the next bar. How are you going to feel if I come back with a pint for me and a tuna butty for you? Are you going to be happy, are you? <laughs> I'll see you later, guys. Thanks for having us. Good night. Bye-bye. <laughs> Mr. Adam Rowe, ladies and gentlemen.